So I'm going to be showing you guys three rejection tricks today, and maybe some variations. On to the tutorial. Alright, so this trick has two rejections in it. So that's the first one. What you're going to want to do first is trapeze, wrap your entire hand around, make sure the string is at the edge of your thumb. It makes it a lot easier for this. Basically you want to do something similar to a magic drop, go off the front, and pretty much what you're going to want to do is keep this tight, so that way when you go off the front, Make sure it lands, it pops off, like, you know, like, it goes off, like that. Then make sure this string ends up on your thumb. So... And then you're gonna want to earn our mount. And when you're in this position, pinch these two together, and you let go of your non-throw hand thumb as pull onto this so that way there's ten there's tension here and this should flip over if you let go with the tension and you want to land that onto the yo-yo like this and then you would want to put your hand into the slack, like so. Now you flip off this way, and you can take your middle finger out, flip off the undermount, put your thumb here, and land a trapeze on your thumb. Drop that, flip it. So now that you're at this point, you want to cut almost one and a half, bounce off the top and land on the bottom string, and from the front you want to pop it out, sorry about that, I don't know if you're like goldfish but that probably scared me more than it scared you, but in any case when you're here, pop it off, do a trapeze. Alright, so when you're at this point, Hold it like this, basically Houdini, put your thumb here, open up your hands, press it here. The top string here is the one that you want to land it on when you pop it out like this. So Basically you drop everything in on this hand, and you underpass, green triangle, and then, you know, cool rejection, not really. Uh, well, alright. Okay, so here's another one, uh, this is more like a rejection exit, the trick itself is a little bit cooler, but the rejection gives it a nice flashy ending. Uh, you can do this front style, side style, depending which way you want to reject from the back or from the front, here let me just show you. From front style, And from side style. Basically what you want to do is double or nothing with your entire hand, pop it off, and now you're going to want to put your entire hand into this and hold it open. Now here's the tricky part. You want to land back onto this string, but around these two. Then you're going to want to drop this off your hand, and drop this 
and then you want to slide it off your wrist. From here, it's a 360 triangle. What you basically do is, when you move the yo-yo to the side, you do a little flipping motion, and it should generally flip around. It's not too hard to catch, it just takes a bit of practice. So, make sure the loop is large and thin. So. Sorry about the beeping in the last frame. Um, what was my camera dying? In any case, after you get the flip, um, when you do it from a side style throw, you want to pop it out of the back. And you can just land on a trapeze, land however you want. Maybe do a really like do like a whip, like a Brent stole or something. I obviously cannot do that. <laughs> and for front style. Either way looks cool, right? Okay, here we go with the last one. Well, first things first, one and a half, drop it, and the string coming off of your middle finger, you want to underpass that, and then underpass again with this hand so you are in a mock whip mount. So after this, uh, you're in the mock whip mount, um, you pop it up, and you catch this string coming off of your middle finger on your non throw hand thumb. I believe it's called a red glover pop or something. Into a Houdini. From the Houdini you want to pinch this string up here and create the slack like so. And then you pop it off and you want the back string to hit the front of the yo-yo. Your fingers should be curled inwards. At this point, you want to bring the yo-yo to the front so your fingers curl outwards from above. Now, you want to swing it over this hand. And then, you're going to want to un underpass it onto this string coming off of your index finger. Underpass it onto this string coming off of your index finger. You should have a green triangle well, backwards. Drop that and then swing it over. From that point, it the rejection time is almost come. In any case, okay. So you grab so the string coming off your middle finger again, and now you want to pop it from here and go all the way around and onto this string. And now you drop into the green triangle at the end. After that, you can pretty much apply my these and make a combo. Um, or not, because I suck. Okay, bye! <laughs>